Walgreens. This Walgreens here shut down for good today, catching a lot of customers off guard. And now some city council members are trying to delay these shutdowns. Confused customers finding the lights on, but the door locked. Signs posted saying this Hyde Park Walgreens closed for good today. It's part of a group of closures. The signs already gone at the one in Nubian Square. And here in Mattapan, people rush to get their final prescriptions. I think it's, it's sad. It's like this is a convenient Walgreens for us. The Walgreens in Nubian Square closed Tuesday. The one in Hyde Park closed today, and the one in Mattapan closes Thursday. The locations in black communities have some city councilors concerned. Tanya Fernandez Anderson telling News Center 5 for too long, corporate businesses have treated black, brown, and working class communities essentially as though we are second class citizens. I'd like to hear why. I don't think anybody knows, even the people who are working in the store, why this is closing. That's a little frustrating. Walgreens says the stores closed due to the dynamics of the local market and changes in the buying habits of our patients and customers. But customers aren't buying it. There was always people here. It's never quiet. Now Walgreens is sending customers to other locations, sometimes right across the street, but in other cases, simply too far to walk. I walk here. Yeah, I literally live right on River Street right there. It's super close. It's like walking distance. It's unfortunate that they've decided to get rid of something that so many people here in Mattapan and in Milton use. And members of the Boston City Council issued a resolution today calling for Walgreens to not open any new stores until they postpone closing these ones. Live in Hyde Park, Sean Shive on WCVV News Center 5.